Los Angeles traffic, so great. Woo! Woo! See all this? Parking lot. It's a parking lot in both directions. <laughs> See, I tried to update my iPhone today to the new MMS so you can send pictures. Because that's, that's the great iPhone. It can do anything in the world except for this one thing that every other phone can do. Anyways, uh, my phone says that uh, there's a something something error and I have to like start it over and go back to the factory settings. Which also says I'm going to lose all my pictures and and contacts and stuff. And I can't do that. I have so many contacts on my phone. And if I lose yeah, them, it's just like a nightmare to try to get all those phone numbers all back. All pictures. I have over 1,400 pictures. Yeah, like that's... 1,400 cool. pictures at least, I know, in my phone. Like good pictures of the kids, YouTube Live. Yeah. And I never backed them up because I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. I never backed them up on my computer. Whatever. So we're trying to go to the ice store, ice store, the Apple store, the Mac store. store. We're trying to go to Steve Jobs' house right now, and we're gonna knock on his door and see if he can fix my iPhone. <laughs> That's what we're doing. And mommy wants a new phone, right? Yeah. How long have you had that phone, mommy? Four years. This Christmas, four she'll years. have this. She'll have had this phone for four years. It's my baby. It still works. Why'd you get another one? It's 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 died on me many times. If it ain't broke, it don't keeps, fix it. It comes back to life. Keeps coming. Keeps coming. Hey, Vitard, what are you looking at? Ooh. What are you seeing out there? You see in Los Angeles? Yeah. Is that your baby you got? Baby. That's your baby. This is literally like if you were to say if you were to say okay what is the worst time. To, to try to get in on the freeway. It would probably be right now. Friday night at like 6 in the evening. Everybody wants to get home for the weekend. It's just ridiculous. And this is total... This is a, yeah. Why'd you turn this on? I'm just frustrated. Take that crap. I'm going to start doing this one. Let's see if we can interview somebody on the side. That would be fun. Sir, excuse me. Let's see if you can film somebody. Nobody's stopping in this line! <laughs> Concho! That was not mine! Wow! Lying. Abusive! Can you see that? I am abusive. Can I get over? I need to get over. Okay. We have, we have walked around parking garages for 30 minutes before. So, we're at Blue B34. Don't forget that. And level this parking... B. Level B. Blue B34. Blue, blue oh. Balls 34, right here. And this parking garage has um, lights to say, like, look, red light means there's somebody parked here. Green light, you see the green light down there? Well, it's supposed to be like there's a spot open, I think. But obviously there's a car there. I think, yeah, it must be broken. Because I think you're supposed to be able to drive around and just look for the green lights to find a spot. But there's somebody parked here. Maybe it's from, because they're from Florida. I don't know. Anyways. We're, um, we don't even know where we're at. We have no idea where we're at. We're, apparently there's an iPhone store. There's an Apple store in here, so we're gonna go try to fix the phone. Okay, watch. This one is working. Okay, so it's green. There's no car. Now here, film me. I'm driving in. Green, green, green. Driving in and perch. And... Not yet, you're not a car. I'm a big fat car. Keep trying to be a car. Oh, you're a car. I'm a car? Yay! Yes. <laughs> I'm not sure what that says about my weight <laughs> issue. The parking garage thinks I'm a vehicle. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Hurry, let's go. Let's leave him. Let's leave him. <laughs> what is that? You want to be an Abercrombie and Fitch model? Come on. Come on. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. Let go of that lady. Come on. Let's go. Got the baby tarred. Uh, we're here in the uh, Apple store. Finally made it. And uh, he informs me that I just have to hit the, re the redo thing. And hopefully my information is stored from the last time I updated it to the 3.0 version. Anyways, so we're here with Suntard. And I'm just putting, um, I'm just editing 
the final touches on my video because I hit upload before we left to come here. And um, Suntard, come here. Suntard says something to me. Okay, what did you just say to me? Um, Scooby Doo, call me up to <laughs> No. What's the That's not what you said. He just said, Dad, how did you get your picture on this other computer? Remember that? Remember you said that? What did I say? Yeah, um, uh, I just want to see your picture all over the world. Yeah, that's right. Did you hear that? I said, you can see, everybody in the entire world can see this picture. And he, because he just thought that only our videos were on our computer. So when we were on this new computer, he's like, Dad, how'd you get the picture on this computer? So anyways, teaching the kids how the interwebs work. Baby Tard, quit sucking your thumb. Everyone around the world can see that. How embarrassing for you. <laughs> oh, dang it. Look, we're on TV. Oh, that was lag. Is it lag? Oh, look at me! <laughs> You're just on TV. Good job. I know. After the commercial. You guys, this is our show. Move. We're on first. <laughs> but who's on second? Get it? That's like an old... Oh, look! Woohoo! Where's the camera at? No one knows. We're going to find it. Wait, am I looking at it? I bet it's like over there. It has to be the front of us. Oh, I bet it's like in there. Oh, oh it's right there. Oh, yeah. Vampires can't see reflections. <laughs> ah, there's a crow attacking me! <laughs> look, wait, okay, wait, I'm on TV now. Wait. Oh, oh, look at me. Look. Check this out. Only, I think this is Dyson, like the vacuum cleaner. But check this out. You slide your hands in there, and it shoots air. I'm going to try this. Get my hand wet first. Nice and soaking wet. Whoa! Not bad. Give it a few passes. Turn it back on. That's kind of scary. That looks pretty good. I'm pretty impressed. Just put it in front of it and it'll, it's automatic. Whoa. Look at all that fancy technology. Okay, rub your hands together. Scrub them together, your hands. Oh, good. Now sing, you have to sing. Twinkle, twinkle, little star, how I wonder what you are. Like a, no, no, not yet. You have to finish the whole song. Like a diamond in the sky. Twinkle, twinkle, I forgot, I lost, okay. How <laughs> I wonder what you are. Okay, I think you're good. <laughs> nice dance. Okay, now wash them off. Get all the germs off. You guys ever hear that? You're supposed to sing Twinkle Twinkle Little Star. And that's how long it takes to kill the germs on your hand. I can't remember where I learned that, but you pick it up in parent school. I get to use the hand dryer. Put both hands in. Put both hands in there. <laughs> it looks like it's going to capture you and suck you into some vortex. There you go. Now pull your hands out slowly. Pull your hands out slowly. No, that was fast. Do it slow. Did it hurt? It's hot! You was. Alright, let's go. There's some guy in there thinking, what are they doing? Why are you guys so slow? <laughs> Come on. That's Judd Apatow. He made that movie Funny People. It's really... I'm like, I'm nervous right now. Yeah, he made he made that movie. Suntard. So, so we're here at the mall, just hanging out with Judd Apatow and my family. And these guys. So, what do you guys want to eat tonight? Is it filming Italian? Or? Houston's. Let's go to Houston's. Houston's. Right All right, let's go. Okay, I'll be over there. <laughs> Love your guys' stuff. That's awesome. <laughs> so, how does it feel? We just hung out with Judd Apatow and Leslie Mann. They're so popular what, now. what do you think, kids? Huh? Your daddy's a movie star now. Hey! I'm going to a movie theater. 
They don't care. They're like, who? What? Huh? We're beating each other up. You guys have your seatbelts on, by the way? Anyways, I was so nervous. I know that's silly. I didn't think I would. Like, any other celebrity, he he's the kind of guy I would love to work with. Uh, you guys have seen Funny People, Knocked Up. He's done a lot of other stuff. That's his wife, Leslie Mann, and she's always, like, uh, one of the lead roles in the movies. Uh, they were cool, really nice. I didn't know what to say. I was nervous. I was like... What should I say? I was afraid he was going to yell at me or something. Anyways. Cool. I'm famous now. That's, I, I will probably tell that story for the rest of my life. <laughs> so sit down. Let me tell you about the time I met Judd Apatow. So we are sitting at dinner. This place called Houston's. Nice little place in Santa Monica. What? Oh, that's the other thing. As I said, that was my little joke. I was like, so we're just hanging out. Where should we go eat tonight? Whoa, and he goes, Houston's, and he goes, well, I'll meet you there. So in my mind now, I'm like, honey, maybe we should really go to Houston's. <laughs> and she's like, no, he's not really gonna be there. He was just saying that. Like he would really be like, oh, a fan, let's go out to dinner. <laughs> but what if, what if he's like, maybe he said Houston's like suggesting it, and then he's like, hmm, that actually sounds good. I think I will go there. And we showed up and we ended up getting table right next to him. And he's like, hey, you're the guy we saw in the mall. You got a nice beard. Come sit with us, and we sit down. Maybe we get we get, we order the same thing, and it's like, you like prime rib, medium rare too, with sour cream and bacon bits and butter on your on your hot potato. We're meant to work together. Dream, 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 dream. <laughs> a man's got to have a dream, hadn't he? About Chad Apatow, keep dreaming. <laughs> <laughs> Mazel tov. <laughs> I feel like we just had a milestone in life. That song came on and Sundar goes, Oh, I love this song. Dad, can you turn it up, please? Bye, yes, son, I can. Let's do it. 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 Wow, Judd Apatow, seriously, such an honor to meet you. I love your movies. No, Shea Carl, it is my honor. Mine, Judd Apatow's great honor to be in one of your YouTube videos.